This video shows the development of ankle exoskeleton by robotizing double bar ankle foot orthosis to contribute to exoskeleton robotics. This exoskeleton device was developed in ATR, Japan, collaborated with Kansai Medical University Hospital toward rehabilitation therapy for afterstroke patients. In gait rehabilitation, assisting ankle joint is very important because ankle manages key functions of balances, push-off, heel strike, and so on. However, assisting ankle is still challenging because it needs to back drivable to quickly and softly respond in heel strike and to generate large torque, especially push-off in stance phase. Simultaneously, the weight and inertia has to be sufficiently small to minimize interference to the swing phase. Not only actively moving, but also the ability to freely move when the torque is not applied by the actuator is important, since the training goal is to improve gait of users. Geared motor may not be appropriate for this objective. More importantly, last decade have not been implemented into society because of complexity and cost of exoskeleton device. The question is what is an acceptable design to rehabilitation facilities and why conventional designs could not break through the limitations. One possible approach is to cope with this limitation is to robotize a device that is already being widely applied in clinical situations. Thus, our approach is robotizing an ankle foot orthosis, which is widely used in rehabilitation facilities by newly designing a modular joint, a tensioner for a pneumatic actuator with board and cable force transmission system. This movie clip shows the target trajectory tracking performance using sinusoidal pattern of one hertz, similar to a typical gate cycle. The pressure input is generated field forward model using iterative learning control strategy. It was able to track the same one hertz sinusoidal trajectory even when the subject was wearing the A4. The stability is empirically investigated. We disturbed the movement of the robotized system, but the response was stable. The last video clip showed that our robotized A4 system can freely move if pumps were not activated. This is a desirable property for rehabilitation to encourage patient voluntary movement. For more information, please check our proceeding and come to our presentation in ICRA 2018.